fun with paint. Hey, hey, hey! Let's have fun! Computers are useful for work and studies, but they can be great tools for fun too. When making a drawing on paper, you need your art book, pencils, eraser, paint or crayons, etc. When making a drawing on a computer, we need a program called MS Paint. This is the icon of paint. To start the program, on the desktop, find the paint icon and double click on it. Alternatively, you can click the start button and choose the paint program from the menu. MS Paint is a powerful image editing tool. You can save images, edit them, change their size, etc. with this program. On opening the program, the paint window appears. The components of paint window are title bar, paint button, home tab and view tab. The ribbon displays the groups of each of these tabs. Paint tools. Paint has many tools to help you draw and edit your drawing. You can find paint tools in the tools group of home tab. It contains the following tools. Pencil tool, eraser tool, fill with color and text. Pencil tool. Pencil tool is used to draw with free hand as you draw using a pencil on your drawing book. To make a simple drawing by using pencil tool, follow the given steps. Click on pencil tool from the tools group of home tab. Now the mouse pointer turns into a pencil. As you move your mouse pointer on the canvas, the pencil will start drawing. Eraser tool Eraser tool is used to erase the unwanted parts of your drawing. This is similar to the eraser you use for pencils. However, this eraser tool can erase all marks of all colors. Fill with color tool Fill with color tool is used to color your drawings. There are two color options, color 1 and color 2. To change color 1 or color 2, click on color 1 or color 2 and then choose a color from the color palette. The respective color 1 or color 2 will change. Here, color 1 is set to brown and color 2 to green. To fill color 1, click left mouse button and to fill color 2, click right mouse button. Text tool Text tool is used to write text in your drawings. To write text on the canvas, click text tool from the tools group. Move the mouse pointer to canvas area. You will notice that the shape of the pointer has changed. Click on the canvas where you want to write text. A rectangle box will appear. Start typing from the keyboard. Like you may want to label your drawing as mountains. You will see that the color of the text is brown as color 1 is brown. We can draw different shapes with the help of shapes tool. There are rectangles, ovals, stars and many other shapes available. Let's learn about curve tool. Curve tool is used to make curved lines in the drawing. A curve is a bending line drawn on the canvas. With the help of this tool, you can draw perfect curves on any part of your drawing. To draw a curve, click on Curve tool in the Shapes group. The cursor will change to crosshair shape. 
select color and the required thickness. Now go to the canvas area and draw a straight line on the canvas. Take your cursor to the position that you want to curve. Click and drag the mouse till the desired curve is obtained and then release the mouse button. Repeat the above step if you want to bend the line from some other place. Remember that you can curve the line only twice. Now a dotted rectangle will appear around the shape to tell you that the shape has been finalized. MS Paint offers a lot of interesting brush types. One of these is airbrush and it's really cool to use. It is used to give a look of spray painting in the drawing. To use airbrush tool in your drawing, click on home tab. Click the pull down button on brushes tool. Select airbrush from the brushes as shown. Select color of your choice from color 1. Move mouse pointer to the canvas. Click the mouse button where you want to spray the color. You can go back and choose different colors to spray paint with multiple colors. You can also paint a Christmas tree now by following these steps.